how to add a page border on Microsoft 365 or Microsoft Word. In this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to add a page border like this. As you can see, you can add it in all your pages. You can design a page like this. Use it for your birthdays. You can use it in doing any other thing that you want to do. So today, I'm going to show you step by step on how to actually add page border on your Microsoft Word. So let's get started. So to actually add page borders like this, as you can see on my screen here, I'm going to show you. You can still add a page border like this and then use any color of your choice that you want. So I'm going to show you step by step on how to do it in one or two minutes. So let's get started. You go to the search button here. You you search on, let's say, you want Word, Microsoft Word. You just click on Word. Let's create a new page, yes. And then you go to new page. We want to create a new uh, a page border on our Microsoft Word. This is our Microsoft Word page, as you can see here. So I want to create a page border on our design. I will design a page such that you can actually do a birthday page or do any other thing that you want to add on the Microsoft Word. So let's go. When you open your Microsoft Word like this, you just go to design. Click on design. When you click on design, on the top right hand you are going to see page borders. You click on page border this page is going to open like this page border and shading as you can see these are different designs non box shadow so i'm going to take this one you can take any of this let me take this let me choose this one because i want i want to design my page like this so i'll click here as you can see when you click here you are going to see it right on the right hand you have this four box here 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 so you start from here with the styles yeah, these are different styles. If you want to design any style, if you want any style, if you want this design, you choose this design. If you want this, so I will go with this. I want this design. This, this one. I love this design. Yes. So you can, if you want to use just uh, the left side, you can choose here. As you can see, this arrow, you can choose here. If you want to use only the two sides, you don't want to shade the two, this other two, this up and down, you can do it like this. If you want to remove all, you can remove if you want to add all you can still add it here so that it becomes square since i want to design a page border i'm going to use it like this so after using style i'm going to go to color you go to color here this next step is to go to color you can choose any color of your type of your choice let me go with this one let me go with this one if you wish it's up to you you can choose any other color we have colors in green blue we have yellow any other color that you want to use let me go with orange or uh let me go with green okay let me go with green okay right down here you are going to see if i want to use this design i can use this design to design my page if i want to use this i can still use this design it's up to me if i want to use this i can use since i don't want to use this i want to go back here i want to use back my 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 design i'll go back here yes this is the design i want to use you can go with any other design let me go with green as we said okay at the end of it when you are done changing your colors and the design you just come here where you see apply to you come here you see whole document you see on the whole document if you want to use just this section of the document you can choose this if you want to use this section first page only you want to use only the first page to design just the first page you can click here if you want this section all except first page if you want to exclude the first page and use all the other pages you can choose here so i want to use the whole document so i'll click here and then i click on okay this is the design this is the design as you can see so this is how you add a page border on your microsoft web with this don't be some one-on-one -on -one short and simple if you like this video please give it a thumbs up if you have any other question if you are confused or you have any other question please just go to the comment section and i'll reply you as fast as possible if you are a member of this awesome family please just like comment and share if you haven't subscribed please do so because it's going to encourage me to do more videos thank you for tuning in and i would like to see you next time in my other videos goodbye for now bye bye